Hello Panda YouTube, welcome to today's video. In case you guys didn't know, there have been a lot of online events happening lately, and a few of them have been terrorized by a young man on the west coast known as Dom. Our good friend Dom here has taken the Belmonts to new heights, all the way in SoCal, by the way, one of the most competitive regions in the world. And uh, recently, he tore through a Xanadu that we saw, in in including one of our own players, Wadi. So my task today is to watch the Belmont sets and try to figure out what the hell this guy is doing. Oh, and they're starting FD. Okay. Do not let do not let Belmonts go FD. That's a meme. I don't know how it benefits uh, Steve that well. Yeah, I still think no matter what happens here, I still think Belmont's going to be a meme character. Okay, nice recovery. To get back in. What does, <laughs> what does Steve have to, to, to edge guard? <laughs> <laughs> That's a right there. What was Jake? Did Jake try to do a fucking forest smash? He did. Jake tried to. What, 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 what are you doing right there, Jake? You're running back forest smash. I wonder why he decides to do back air there. I wonder if it's any better. Oh, what the hell? Oh, wait a minute. He's a. F he's super smart. He throws the cross left here, and the cross comes back so far it actually throws a hitbox on the ledge. Like, watch. It'll hit the ledge. He even waits a little bit too. That's so smart. And then game done. I've watched this whole match, and I don't really know how he's he's winning. Like, stuff is hitting, and it comes together. Got him. I guess it's because, like, Belmonts don't have, like, a 0 to 80. Like a character like Mario or Pac-Man or, you know, a bunch of other characters do. They just sort of clip you. The, uh, the, the fucking, his side B where he chucks that whatever that is, that's, I feel like that's so good. Versus Steve when he when when he gets trapped in the fucking roller cart, the thing chases after Steve, so he can't really do that much. See, look, look, look at that. That's clean. That's so good versus Steve. And watch this. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Oh. I think Dom could just afford to be a little slower. Jake is just kind of mashing. At this point in the video, you might be wondering. What are are the are these Belmonts top tier? I can't answer that for you. But what I do know is top tier is a panda subscriber. So subscribe to that lovely group immediately. If you know your opponent has any handle on Super Mario, why would you not ban this? I'm shocked that he wins this. Although Dom's very good at like the up close game. Comparatively to other Belmonts, you know? I'm surprised he's still alive. I'm surprised it's not one sock to three right now. If you're playing Mario on this stage, you should have you should have already won. Okay. Oh, is, is he no dead? Okay. Oh. <laughs> He's just going for straight murder. Okay, Jake. Okay, Jake. State farm. I wonder how this match. I don't know what the hell this matchup is. It looks kind of hard for uh for uh. I always forget this character's name. Richter, Joe, Tom, Simon Cowell. Uh, I'm starting to think in my head, Dom didn't deserve this win, and Belmont is trash. Look, he can barely hit him. Versus any mobile character. Like, I understand that you have to be pretty accurate with your attacks, but you also have to guess roughly where they're going to be. Which, uh, if you're getting consistently smacked around by Bel... Okay, whatever. By Belmont forward air up air. I'm sorry, forward air back air. Even up air, you're being predictable. And you need to mix up your, uh, your drift or where you position. Does Dom even win this set? Don't tell me this is a game five set. Did Panda really trick me into watching a game five set with a... Goddamn Belmont. They did. They did. They tricked me. Okay. I'm not, what kind of job? You're not paying me enough for this. I don't know what it is, but like low tier poo poo ass characters, they all turn up their last stock. Like they get shit on their first two stocks. Those, those don't care. It's their last stock where you kind of you kind of just want to close it out because you're tired of playing against a stupid ass character. That's when they turn up. And then it's last stock, last hit, you might lose. That's what's going to happen here. He's trying to close it out. He's getting impatient. I don't blame him. Dom's playing out his mind. This is what can happen when your mind gets shattered. Dom is a mind flayer, and he just sucked all the insight out of Jake, who is now just holding in uh, and is just getting hit over and over. Yeah, Dom is the mind killer. This is so frustrating to fight because you know you're fucking up. You know you're fucking up, but you can't stop. Homie is holding in. The white stick is pointed toward the bad guy. Yeah, it's not happening. Yeah, okay, so that's what Dom's good at. You get the fortress set up and you just frustrate the hell out of that guy. I want to say good job, Dom. 
but I feel like he did kind of the same thing for the most part. He he worked on his accuracy a little bit. Your your opponent didn't adapt when he was up three stocks to one. I'm more disappointed in Jake than more than I'm proud of Dom. All right, we're watching the first set of Wadi versus Dom. Now, this is one of our players. This is supposed to be one of our star players. We just picked up Wadi. What is he doing losing to a low tier? He's on the chopping block. He better watch his ass, dude. We're watching me lose or win. We, you don't know the outcome. I feel like I was playing okay. I was playing fine. You know, nothing crazy. Dom was playing out of his mind. Why is my tag UWU? I don't say that word ever, but I think I was... I think I was... What the hell was wrong with me? Okay, I was under the impression that this Belmont player was uh, some form of aggressive. And that was a really good idea here. So he knows at this point that, like, Wadi kind of has to commit to a shield or a jump. Or, you know, some other form of weirdo defensive option, like a roll. But that would be hard to time, especially because Wi-Fi. So he does this jump near here to cover jump. And if Wadi commits to shielding, it's basically unpunishable because he just shielded cross. Yeah, and he crossed him up. Come on, Wadi. Come on, Wadi. Definitely a lot more comfortable this matchup, but I love that little setup. That that, 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 that that's Wi-Fi. I couldn't take it. I couldn't take it because of the Wi-Fi. There was a there was a small little lag spike. You you guys couldn't see it. The, the human eye couldn't see it, but I could, and I missed it. That's why I couldn't take there. Not because I suck. So the thing with Rob is that if you can beat his landings, you can beat him. Oh my God, I love that. Hold on, look at that. This looks so impractical. He's drinking the juice, right? He's drinking the Dasani, which will surely short circuit him. He throws out the cross. I've never seen this before. He throws out the cross, but it's not to hit him initially. It's to catch him. Like, what is this? That would f me off if I got hit by that. I, I'm a human being, and I deserve agents. Okay. He's running me. You ain't getting me with that ever. Oh! No! I'm not even lying. I'm not lying. I, in my head, was like, okay, I don't get hit here. He tries to go for the up air, and I got fooled fucking twice. I forgot he did that to me. Oh, he wants it. Yeah, he wanted it again. As soon as he did that jump after the cross, the, the, the holy water. It was optimal, too. Like, it wasn't even like he was flexing. But he just read the air dodge in the best way possible. Because he can align himself properly instead of just kind of guessing on a space. He does, he does such a good job at, like, mixing up. Like, in other situations, after that shield, after that back air got shielded, sometimes he'll go, go for, like, a jump read. Because people will, like, sometimes jump away. But uh, he responded properly and just shielded instead of waited. Which is smart. Yep, that's what you get for jumping versus Belma in the corner, you fool. Oh, I swapped? What is wrong with me? I, I hadn't played Mewtwo in like four days. I was rusty. That's why. I, I Otherwise, this would have been a three-stock my way. This stream just became bullying Wadi gameplay. You know what it really is? It's that Belmont puts you in positions to look like an idiot. It's not Wadi's fault. Belmont makes everybody look so stupid. All right, I'm kind of, not gonna lie, I'm kind of, uh... Embarrassing myself right now. Okay, what you got? See, look, I, I don't know what I'm doing right now. I don't. I don't. I don't I'm scared. I'm scared. Look at all this option coverage, dude. That's why Belmont's so good on Wi-Fi. Because, like, I mean, versus Belmont, you're already almost always guessing. If you get a read on their tempo, you can fish for parries. But, like, after this, like, situation, why do you either, like, has to jump or assume that there's going to be another F tilt because that's just the two best zoning options to like try to read. Or, you know, you can cover both You can cover both options by simply staying in shield, which I think is, yeah, Wadi decides to go back into shield or maybe fish for a parry. Dom tries to read a jump and like, he's just he just stays in this extremely advantageous position. And like, if this was offline, you could fish for a parry pretty well because it's not like Dom's mixing up his timings on his like grounded moves or aerials. He's throwing them out as soon as he possibly can, which makes it easy for parries. I don't think Wadi knows that a parry is kind of trash, but that's one thing. That's a, a big reason why uh, this character gets buffed on Wi-Fi. You can't really parry them. Why y'all got me watching this, huh? To embarrass me some more? Huh? Make me look like poo? Talk about how bad I am. I Oh, Wadi with his f***ing UWU tag. It's kind of poo. <laughs> he just waited. That's insane. That is, dude, this guy just understands exactly where you're going to pop out at literally every position. Look at this. Cross is out. Fire is out. He doesn't go for the obvious thing, which is just the forward air, right? Pretty much every Richter that doesn't have enough experience with the character is just going to forward air you here. And maybe you would just die from that anyway. But now you're just chilling. You're waiting. The cross hits you, and then you up B. 
How does anyone know that's how this character functions? Yeah. Oh, there you go. You got it. I got one here. reflected. <laughs> I joined. I, not joined. I I, I played B2. I switched to B2 for the reflect, and I think I reflected maybe two things. <laughs> his, his projectile usage was immaculate this set. I gotta say, he was making it very hard. Stop it. Oh. He was making it very hard. Not to die. Yeah, so now it's just a projectile war and Wadi's gonna win that. Ironically, Dom is better at the up close. Like, he's winning the up close game against Wadi a lot, even on Rob. When it comes to this projectile war, he doesn't seem to be faring as well. He's really good at that middle distance, like I said. Like, the mid range is where he's very good. Long range, you just have these super laggy moves like that cross, and that can just get lasered through, you know? I'm playing pretty good here. I'm not even paying attention to the dog. Let me have, let me have my moment, okay? Let me talk about how cool I am. Look at that. You think I'm done with you? You think I'm done with you? Let me give me one more. Every time you hit this character, you try to kill him. You don't play. You don't let the Belmonts play more neutral. Same with, like, it's, it's the same as, like, Diddy. You cheese him. You don't let him play more neutral. The, the less neutral interactions, the better. You gotta be careful here because Dom, is, this is a character where if you get impatient and you just want to close this shit out, they can bring it back on you without you even realize what the f happened. No! Oh, okay. Oh no, it's already. See, look, I have such a high lead. This is like Jake all over again. But do I close it out? I don't know. Just fight long range. You don't win up close. He is the superior player. He's the alpha. Don't fight up close. Use the laser. Use your future technology. Yes! All of his family died to the bubonic plague. Use your modern advancements, Rob. Yes, perfect. Yes. Good. You killed the surf. Keeping his ass on the ledge. Oh. Okay. Just yet. That was it. That that was a clean recovery. Oh. He parried that, dude. Dom is a fucking monster. His recoveries are so good with such with a character notorious for poo recoveries. He knows how to make that back. I do not think the Belmonts are a top tier character. Uh, that's the whole conceit of this video. Is like, how good do you think Belmonts are? I don't think Belmonts are this good. I think Dom just has a, a brain that's shaped like an H or something, like. Like, there are some brains that are just shaped in a different way. You know what I mean? Like, it doesn't... I don't know what's going on up there. God, this looks so unfun for both sides. Well, specifically for Wadi. He just has to wait patiently for his opening. And good games, kid. That's what you get. That's the, uh, that's the character difference. <laughs> oh, you have to hit me a couple times? Yeah, I just nary you at 70 at the end. Good games, kid. Did I mention there's unpunishable? People think Belmont's hard. I'm sure there's like a faction of people out there that think that Belmont is like a very difficult character. But like, like I said, it's just learning set play and reacting to your combos. Look, that's not fair. Look at that. Look how far it went. Oh, no. I, what? I didn't even know that it was that strong. When I got hit by it, I was like, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm probably fine right here. That's it. And then I just uh, died. I, hey, I learned a lot about Richter, that set, and yeah, Dom, amazing player. I, I was impressed. I, can we get some claps for him, something? I don't know. Yeah, okay, so the point of this video was to see, like, is Belmont top tier? No. No, Dom is a freak of nature. Dom is a hell demon masquerading as a as a man of God. Yeah, Belmont, still mid. And that's it. Thank you for watching.